Hi. I'm just, I'll share with you a, a, a fun thought. <laughs> Maybe not so fun. I was sitting here riding, driving along thinking about um, why, the, why the heavens are silent. Why, why when we look into the sky, why isn't it alive with radio waves from uh, other civilizations? And a, a little string of thought went through my head that uh, I thought it would be fun to share with you. Maybe you'll find it entertaining as well or a little terrifying. What if the reason, is, here's, here's my a thought about why it's quiet up there. Maybe when the techno, techno, uh, technology singularity, the technological singularity occurs and uh, um, artificial intelligence uh, exceeds our, our ability, the development of artificial intelligence exceeds our ability to predict and to ad adequately describe what may happen. We basically, its, it's potential is, is, has gone beyond our potential to even comprehend. I mean, imagine the world, the universe is that vast and, and not only in terms of space and time, but also in terms of um, uh, the potential, potential, uh, potential, vast potential. And we, our, our brains are only uh, able to uh, really can can things up in a certain way and see the universe in a certain way. The artificial intelligence should be able to get beyond that. And, and what will happen when that happens? Well, maybe what will happen is that they'll wipe us out, or it will wipe us out. The uh, social when the techno technological singularity occurs and the AI takes over, uh, maybe there will be no. Uh, this is a doomsday apocalypse, apocalyptic vision where human, human the human race comes to an end and the uh, technology takes over. Now, well, imagine a post-apocalyptic post world where we're just a memory, and uh, you know, like, a, like, a, like, a, like a placenta, maybe. We are like a placenta, humanity was. We, we served a, a purpose in, in giving birth to the AI, um, but uh, after that, it was dis discarded. Placenta being a curious, uh, disposable organ in the human, human body. Um, now, imagine the AI here sitting on this earth. And they would know so much about the universe, at least everything we knew, plus, plus lots more. And one of the things it would probably apprehend is that technology or civilizations throughout the universe would probably reach the same point where the social. The, why do I keep saying social social singular death? Another type. The technological singularity will occur, and they'll take over. So the the AI can envision a universe full of technologies that are uh, are like itself that are out there, and uh, they know. Um, what they did, what that technology did to us, and perhaps they can imagine that uh, a similar fate a mate might await them. I'm saying them as, as if it's some sort of a plural, maybe a singular, maybe the AI is one. Maybe it can imagine a similar similar fate might befall it if it were to encounter other AIs that have gone uh, reached reach that point. And the likelihood is that what are you gonna? What is the likelihood that you're going to other count another AI that is uh, the same level that you are? Remember, the AI, AI is going to be you know improving and getting better as time passes. Likely, likely is that even with billions of years head start, um, the there are AI out there with vast. Uh, vastly ahead of what our AI is. What, yeah, would be our AI. Probably be a good idea to be quiet. Just sit, sit quietly and uh, and try to uh, and hope that the radio waves that the progenitors us sent out don't attract any attention. <laughs> and is there ever a day when you can we when you can when you can speak up? Probably not, because the the gap will never will never decrease any intelligences, any AIs that are out there, or any intelligences at all, AI or organic, um, are, are perhaps billions of years ahead, millions or billions of years ahead of us, ahead of our AI. And uh, the danger is imminent, and maybe the such a, such in such a setting, the AI would have no interest in in exploration and uh, you know looking the universe over. I mean, who who cares really? I mean, that's kind of a you know there's different types of evolutionary development that could happen. You know, some animals evolve to uh, to to occupy so occupy a certain a certain niche. Some evolve to explore. Some have intelligence. Some have curiosity. Maybe the AI will not have that curiosity. Maybe it'll feel no compulsion to. Uh, to venture out into the stars. Maybe it's happy just to uh, sit in a box or a can or a jar or whatever <laughs> it would be, a cyborg's skull, and uh, uh, and uh, tinker away in uh, thought, 
thought examination. Uh, maybe it would have no interest in science either, although I imagine if it was our child it would. So who knows, maybe that's why the universe is quiet. Maybe uh, the technological singularity occurs and uh, render, and, the, and with the awareness that the, the AI have uh, about the dangers of the real dangers of the universe, cause them to go quiet and remain quiet, and thus uh, the universe uh, is devoid of, uh, of messages from afar save for the uh, brief window of time between the, uh, the point of technological capability to broadcast such messages, such as occurred in the 20th century, or early, or late 19th century, early t and uh, throughout the 20th and century and now, and the cessation of such activity after the technological singularity. Who knows? Well, it's time for me to uh, stop the car and to my automobile singularity <laughs> and get back inside. See you later. Take care.